two equipment you should invest in for a nice back day. So a pull-up bar, very cheap on Amazon. I think this one's around, I think $50, I think $50, but uh, any pull-up bar for your door would be great. Just look at the reviews, that's all. <laughs> and some dumbbells. So these dumbbells cost me around, I bought it at Costco actually, it cost me around $500 for these weights here. So the weights goes from, let's say, five pounds to 52, five, 52, five, 52 five pounds. Get in position, okay? We're just doing some rows, okay? Three sets of 10. Let's go. Come on, get in this. You got this. <laughs> Let's do this. Wait, that felt weird. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five. Just imagine you sawing something. Seven, eight, nine. Good job. You know, let's go 12. One, two. I hit you with the pull up. So three sets of five outside, three sets of five inside, three sets of five more close. All right. Let's go. Dumbbell deadlifts. Three sets of ten. Come on. One. Oh. 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 Five. Come on. Six. Seven. Eight. Oh, big breakfast, half a red pepper, half an orange pepper, and some onion saute. One saute, take out. Got two whole eggs here and two egg whites. Eggs nice and cut, flip, Oh, Low fat cheese, 50 calorie each, eight grams of protein, 2.5 grams of, oh man, look at this cheese. Ow! <laughs> That's why I don't really like low fat cheese, man. Pepper's back on. Ow! Beautiful. <laughs> overflow omelet right here. Plate the overflow omelet right on right the plate here. Next, let me whip you up some Kodak cake. So, Kodak powder, some water, and that's it. Stir until nice and creme. Here we go. A nice big pancake for you. Pancake flip. Oh, yes. Let's squeeze out some fresh oranges for you. Oh, nice and healthy. Some people can be complaining like, Juan, you shouldn't be drinking any orange juice in the morning. Come on now. Come on, I, I, can't, I can't even eat an orange. I can't even drink the orange juice now. <laughs> some people, some people. Hey, Juan, you're gonna use up all your calories while drinking those two oranges. Guys, I'll be fine, okay? I'll be fine, all right? Fresh orange juice and a cup of ice. Here we go, just half of that protein pancake right there. Push you guys close. A little maple syrup. That's before 2020, December. Oh man. Okay, I can't have it. It's just a touch of honey. All right, there, that's it. Boom, bam, delicious. Order 69. Your high protein breakfast is ready, my G. Last thing you do to your eggs, Get some Cholua. Oh man. And I like a little ketchup on mine. Just a touch. Alright, breakfast outside. So look at this. Look how beautiful this is. Beautiful view, beautiful everything. Beautiful jacket, just beautiful everything. Okay. Let's get into this. I don't know what I'm gonna say. I'm just hungry. Look at this omelet. Packed with all that goodness. But on this quick time. It's got nice. Oh man. Super pumped for this. Mm. That's beautiful. That is so beautiful. Mm. Flapjacks. Mm. Just a little water goes a long way, you know? <laughs> Why does it seem so dark? Is it dark in your end? I like eating outside. Eating outside is fun. I do this more often, right? But the weather is nice. Do you know what I find hard seeing? People going out eating a healthy breakfast or buying a healthy breakfast to eat. I 
feel like you're wasting a lot of money if you're going out eating healthy for breakfast. You can make it at home. Hmm? You know what, this and this is really good together, but I don't like it touching, you know? There's some foods that can touch or join together, and some foods that has to be separate when eating, you know? Like for instance, chips. I find it weird when people eat chips. And sandwiches, like they just stuff the sandwiches, chips. I like the eating it on the side. Mm. 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 